Hi guys, I'm Rohan Ravel. Let's have a look at CET in a little more detail. Let's start with logical reason. Now, this is the most important area. As you can see, it comes for around 75 marks total. Okay, the most important area. Now, what all do we have in this? We have verbal side of it, like for example, statement assumptions. You have courses of action. You have statement conclusions. Then you have inferences, assertion, reason, and cause effect. Now, out of these six topics, you would have five of them asked you in the exam. So, which gives you... 5 and 5 25 25 marks will be for these five topics okay apart from that you have some typical logic traditional logical reasoning questions on blood relation direction coding decoding you have clocks here you have calendars you have cubes for that matter you have symbol based logic inequality based logic you have binary logic this can be introduced this year this can be a new addition this year in CET. You have caselets every time. You have at least two caselets. Okay, so around 10 marks on caselets. Okay, and this is how you have the entire logical reasoning divided, giving you 75 marks. Each topic will be asked for at least five questions. All right, so let's move forward. The next most important area is verbal reasoning, verbal ability. I'm sorry. Uh, obviously, it comes for 50 marks, so it becomes very important. However, it has lesser topics than logical reasons. So you have sentence correction, you have grammar, you have reading comprehension. Now reading comprehension will play a very important role in CET. Okay, you earlier in CET you used to have 15 questions on one one RC only. Now you have three RCs sometimes of five questions each, or maybe like two RCs of seven and eight respectively. Okay, you have para jumbles, you have FIBs, fill in the blanks, you have sentence completion. Okay. Moving on, the most important again uh, after these two would be visual reasoning because it comes for 30 questions, 30 marks. You have analogy, you have series, you have missing elements, you have mixed visuals, you have advanced visuals. And that, that's about it. Every set will be asked for 5 questions and this is how we get 6 sets and 5 questions per set giving you 30 marks total. Okay, then you have the last two sections, data interpretation and quant. They don't have as much weight as the others have. 25 and 20 is the only weight that they have. So, but still, the number of topics that can be asked in these areas are very diverse. Okay, so let's understand. In DI, you have line graphs, you have pie charts, you have tables, you have bar, you have mixed, you have advanced. Okay, these six things. Okay, and in quant, you have the arithmetic, which is the first few topics that I've written, percentage, profit loss, SI, CI, mixtures, allegation, ratio, time speed, time work. All these are arithmetic topics. This will constitute for around 70% of the paper. Probability, co permutation, combination will be asked for at least five questions. Okay. Numbers, progression, higher math, etc. can be asked for around another five questions. And then you have board mass and speed math sometimes asked you directly. Okay. So this is how your 200 marks are divided completely. And this is what our online CET schedule will be like. Okay. So 4th of January to 11th of January. Okay. So we started our batch on 4th of January, which I mentioned in my earlier videos. So 4th of Jan, uh, this week we're going to cover 1, 2 and 3, 3 topics only. Okay, so in logical reasoning we'll have statement assumptions, quant we have percentage and DI you'll have line graphs as an introduction session. Okay, so you'll have around 6, 5 to 6 videos, okay, on this topics, okay. So next week and so on and so forth. So, to, so precisely in the first week of March we'll just have revision lectures going on and we'll be able to finish our syllabus by Feb last week. All right. So by the last week of February, you'll be finished with the entire syllabus. You'll be done with the syllabus. All the videos will be up and running and you can view them one more time because CT is going to be around in the third week of March. So you can view the videos one more time. Okay. And get an entire feel of the lectures again and revise, your, revise yourself and get a JBIMS. All my good luck and support with you. Also, one last thing for the day, how will this how will this entire online CT batch work is this, I'll be giving you handouts, so first I'll have a handout, let's say for example, this week we're going to do statement assumptions, so for assumptions I have a handout which has 20 questions on assumptions, so I'll be solving all these 20 questions, explaining you every concept of assumptions and then taking it forward, then I'll give you some few practice material of the same topic, assumptions. And then finally, I'd suggest please write mocks and solve the questions that you have on assumptions. I mean, you'll solve all the questions, obviously, but focus more on the assumption questions and understand that whether you can apply all the techniques that I've taught you during the class. Okay. Uh, if you want to enroll for our CT batch, you can go to www.numbers.com. Click here to register for the CT batch. In, you'll be redirected to my portal, Learn with Guru. Now, they have, we've increased the batches. 
precisely we just don't have lectures and mocks we also have combo batches like here it is CET mocks discussion lectures combo uh, CET mocks is obviously the mocks lectures are my online lectures what is discussion out here discussion out here precisely means that I will be discussing every question of the mock with you guys and that again will be it will be a video okay where I'll be solving every question so one by one okay and I'll also give you the thought that comes to my mind while solving this, that question and what should be the focus when you solve that question anyway uh, and finally you have CT mocks for discussion if you don't want to take any online lectures you can just take this you can also take a free demo mock of ours by clicking on take a test now you just fill an enrollment form and you can just take the test and you can get a feel of the, how the portal is and how our designs are like because our designs precisely are exactly the same as the actual CT designs okay I hope you enjoyed this video thank you very much for watching